Hey, I'm Carly. And I'm Monica. Today is September 8th, 2023. And this is Charger Current News. FFA call fall committee applications are, are due by September 14th. There is a new deadline as we had no applications. This is available to FFA members, high school or middle school. This is just another way to get more involved with our FFA chapter events and activities. If you have any questions, please ask. FFA chapters will be due September 14th to Miss Bell. Chapter dues are $30 each. each. District kickoff is, September, is on September 21st, 2023 at Ivy Tech Lafayette. The first FFA meeting will be September 14th, 6.45 to 3 to 8.30 p.m. at Oak Hill. There will be a bonfire with food, so members need to bring their roasting sticks. We have dress-up days for next week. Monday is pajama day. Tuesday is hat day. Wednesday is decades day. Sixth is 2000s, seventh is 90s, and eighth is 80s. Thursday is sports day. Friday is spirit color war. Sixth is white, seventh is orange, and eighth is blue. Let's check on the weather for this weekend. Hey, I'm Isaiah. And I'm Zach. And this is Charger Current Weather. We are going to be telling you this weekend's weather forecast. Friday will be a high of 72. And Saturday will be a high of 74. Lastly, Sunday will be a high of 77. Looks like this weekend is kind of cool, so stay outside and have fun and stay kind. Back to you, Annika and Carly. That's really interesting. Thanks for the info, Zach and Isaiah. Now let's go check on sports. Thank you, Annika and Carly. Now here's our sports for next week. First on Monday, we have cross country. And it will be away. Then we have tennis boys versus Levin. Lebanon, sorry. And then we have our soccer team versus Greencastle. And it will be home. Then good luck to our great teams. And next is Tuesday. Games. And first one is our soccer team versus Crawfordsville. That will be away. And then we have... Our football team versus Western Boone, and that is going to be home. And then our volleyball team versus Western Boone Juniors and Seniors High School. And then be going also be going away. Good luck to those teams. And next Wednesday we have our cross country county meet. That will be away. Then we're going to have the tennis boys going against Southmont and will be hosted at home. Also, Crossersville will do the same. And then we have 8VB Crossersville and hosted at home. Then for Thursday and Friday, our homecoming. And we'll back to you guys. Thanks for the information, Logan. Let's go to lunch. Hi, I'm Chase. And I'm Ben. And, and this, this is next, next week's lunch menu here at North Montgomery Middle School. On Monday, we'll be having hot dog with a bun, coney sauce, seasoned potato wedges, baked beans, and chilled pears. On Tuesday, we'll be having chicken bites with a warm baked roll, mashed potatoes with gravy, and fruit juice. On Wednesday, we'll be having stuffed cheese breadsticks, with marinara sauce, romaine salad, steamed carrots, fresh apple wedges, and goldfish cinnamon crackers. On Thursday, we'll be having hamburger sandwich with sliced cheese, lettuce, tomatoes, and onions with oven-baked fries, seasoned green beans, and fruit juice. On Friday, we'll be having a beef burrito with refried beans, chips and salsa, baby carrots and dip, and chilled peaches. Thanks for the lunch menu, Ben and Chase. Ben and Logan went out <clears throat> to ask people what they thought about the new schedule. Let's see what they found out. Now let's head to our future selves to go see the question of the week. Alright, what's your opinion on North Montgomery Middle School changing to trimesters to semesters? I like it and I hate it at the same time because in shorter classes we don't got to do as much work but then again the passing periods are shorter. How do you like it how trimesters were turned into semesters? 
Well, I'm in favor of the semester schedule. I've taught both semesters and trimesters. I find at this age the semester schedule uh, lends itself to a more fluent class period. I think the uh, kids don't struggle nearly as much to stay on task. I think the outcomes are going to be you know, far greater. How do you like from changing to trimesters to semesters? I like it because shorter classes, less work to do during the classes. So, how do you like trimesters turning to semesters? I mean, I'm okay with it because it's the third year uh, knowing it, and um, it was difficult at first because you have to do eight classes in general instead of five plus advisory. All right. That's really interesting, Ben and Logan. And that's it for, and that's all for Charger News, Charger Current News. And as always, it's the Charger way all day, every day.